guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video I am unboxing my June Alcrate subscription box this is I believe my fourth month being resubscribed to Alcrate and I'm really enjoying it if you've missed my previous unboxings I will link them down below in the description box if you want to check them out and if you don't know what Alcrate is it is a subscription box that is YA bookish theme so every month you're gonna get a brand new released novel and it's all always signed by the author and it's also normally an exclusive cover so yeah let's just dive in I think this month's theme was something to do with libraries so let's see so every month you usually get a card on top that is normally really cute and has to do with the theme of this month's box and this month's theme was libraries of wonder and then on the back it says spoiler warning and it has all the items listed that come in your subscription box i love that alcrate works with like independent artists and smaller etsy and online shops because you always get a ton of unique items once i moved all the crinkle paper this is what it looks like so let's jump in so the first item in here was actually the sneak peek from last month's box so i knew we were going to get a bag of coffee and this is a book bow brew bell's library nutty and bright so that's what that looks like i'm not a coffee drinker but i have friends and family who love coffee so i'm sure i can find someone to gift this to. The next item comes in this really cute owl crate box and it looks like a coaster set designed with love by KDP Letters. All right so there's four coasters included and they're all super super cute. So the first one says libraries were full of ideas perhaps the most dangerous and powerful of all weapons. This one says, when in doubt, go to the library. Imagine a place where the dead rest on shelves like books. And the last one says, books spoke mind to mind, soul to soul, across the abyss, time and distance. So yeah, those are really cute. I really like those. All right, the next item, oh, looks like bookends. These are really cute. They're metal. Magical lamp post bookends. So you do have two of them. And these were designed with love by Hey Atlas Creative. Beautiful bookends for your home library. And you'll always carry a piece of Narnia with you. So they're supposed to look like the lamppost. Those are so cute. And I, who doesn't love Narnia? Okay, so I love that item as well. Looks like we got a tote bag, which I'm obsessed with tote bags. And this is absolutely gorgeous. Has really long handles. Here is what that looks like. That is so pretty. Let's see. It says... Dream up something wild and improbable, Lonnie Taylor. That is seriously so cute. And let's see. All right, so the tote bag, off on a trip to your local library. Be sure to bring your beautiful exclusive tote bag with you to help carry all the books you check out, inspired by Strange the Dreamer and designed by the amazing Stella Bookish Art. So Alcate works with Stella Bookish Art a lot and everything she creates is absolutely gorgeous so yeah so far i love all the items all right so there's just a few more things this one is like a little key it says write book reviews using your super cute key gel pen and who knows maybe you'll unlock secret passageways with it too chosen just for you by team alcrate so it's a little gel pen it has a really fine tip so that's always nice for a pen and you could probably refill it as well so that's really cute just a little bonus item and then each month you do get an exclusive enamel pen that kind of goes with the theme and it says child of the library that's really pretty so that is really pretty and let me see the enamel pen this month was designed by brio and brandish 
inspired by Sorcery of Thorns, which is the book this month. Here it is, let me unwrap it. So with the book, you usually always get a note from the author on a little card. This month we also got a sticker, Magic Can Twist the Purest Hearts. And here is the book with the gorgeous cover. I've heard a few people on YouTube talk about this book, so I'm excited to read it. It is of course signed by the author as well. Let's see, some of the blurbs on the back. Sorcery of Thorns is a bewitching gem. I absolutely loved every moment of this story. If you love the Hogwarts Library, so I'm, I'm gonna love it, you'll be right at home. Tightly paced, hugely atmospheric with a touch of wry humor. This book had me from its gothic beginning right to the perfect end. This is a classic fantasy at its very best, so. Yeah, I'm really excited to read it. It's set in a library with shelves full of magical and dangerous grimoires. You'll follow Elizabeth as she works to complete her apprenticeship. She is thrust into a plot of sabotage against the great libraries of Ostamir. Probably saying that wrong. <laughs> she teams up with the most unlikely duo, a sorcerer and his demonic servant. This adventure will cause Elizabeth to question everything she thought she knew as she fights to save the libraries she loves. So that sounds absolutely amazing. And then also in every box you get a little pamphlet and it um, always has a little word search and it also shows you the difference between the Owlcrate cover and the original cover. So I definitely love the Owlcrate cover with all the purple. It's really, really pretty. Interview with the author. And yeah, just some cute information. And then you also get a card that talks about next month's box. So the theme of July is tournaments and trials. So that is the sneak for next month. And on the back it says, every box will include the next mug in our series from artist Kara Kozik. So that is what that looks like. So yay, next month we get a mug. Who doesn't love mugs? So that was everything I got in my June Owlcrate subscription box. I really enjoyed this subscription box. So just to recap, we got the book with the exclusive cover that is signed by the author, the coasters enamel pin that you get every month, the gorgeous, gorgeous tote bag, a sticker, which I always love, the bookends, which I am actually really, really excited about. And the coffee and pen. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. If you are subscribed to Alcrate, let me know what your favorite item this month was. If you have read Sorcery of Thorns, let me know what you thought about it. I can't wait to read it probably in the fall. I love reading fantasy in the fall. And yeah, if you want to check out L Crate, I will have it linked down below. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Bye, guys.